Leadership is really vital for an organization and how an individual leads. And there's two different ways that someone can lead. One of them, which is very well known, is the hierarchy of that top-down approach. Um, it's my way or no way. It's um, you can't make a decision without me being involved. Very much the information is held within inside. Um, another form of leadership is what I find a lot of value in and what I practice myself is letting go of that control and empowering others to have the decision making that is occurring. And sometimes as leaders, we struggle with that because we're thinking, well, if we give that control over or that power, what's going to happen? It's our license on the line. It's, you know, we always can find a reasoning why we shouldn't be empowering others to help make those decisions. And I think um, leadership, the mindset changing to that mentoring role and teaching and learning and growing and teaching others of what to look for and what to do as a leader. Um, because if we hold all that stuff in, who's learning from that? And that continues to have the control within us. And I think we struggle as leaders to let go of that. Um, I think that um, a lot of times um, it's our own questioning of, well, what is our role if we do let that go? And I think um, what I find value in is what I've seen over the years is just watching individuals light up because now they see as a caregiver working directly with the residents that they have that empowerment to make that decision. And when I teach or mentor different individuals or in a orientation setting, I say, you're in control. You have the power and go make a difference for those individuals that you're serving. Make it happen to whatever they want to that day go do it, you know, and that excitement that comes over and realizing that they have some control of what's going on too, instead of feeling like if I want to go get Dairy Queen with the residents, I've got to go through the administrator. Or I've heard of or other organizations, it goes from the caregiver to the director of nursing to the administrator, I've actually heard one time that actually goes to the board. And I think by the time it goes through all that process, it's done, it's deflated. They just want to go to Dairy Queen. And so how can we change that so that takes that back?